money. Some people say it's the root of all evil. Get on the stage. I just want to let everybody hear me sing. I don't want to be an open bit on the stage. <laughs> Those people are freaking idiots. Money rules, we all know it. How's it going? Handsome Jack here, your best friend. You know what sucks? Everything, all the time. There's wars, there's poors, and not enough fire in the galaxy to burn it all down. That's why I built my ultimate getaway, the Handsome Jackpot. You're welcome. I, by myself and me alone with no one's help at all, combined Hyperion's most advanced space station engineering with the most opulent casino the galaxy has ever seen. The only thing that's better looking than this place is me, baby, and you're not going to be able to look in any direction without seeing this handsome mug. Spend your money in the lap of luxury, your every whim catered to by our automated staff of robots. Full service. I'm looking at you, robo perverts. Stuff your fat, greasy mitt with caviar like you know what that is, and let it hang open in wonder as you behold the greatest live entertainment money can buy. The handsome jackpot. Once you're here, you're never going to want to leave. Jack's dead, but he left some things behind. I want that casino. Ready to bring down the house, sugar? I'll keep Sanctuary away from the casino before we all become permanent guests. Jack's idea of a good customer was one that couldn't leave. Handsome Jack. Ah, what an arse you were. This Jack sounds like a real dildo. Jack sure sounds like a total wang. Was Jack really that big of a dick? <laughs> At least those have redeeming qualities. Jack was a tyrant and a bastard to his core. The only thing he loved more than himself was making others hurt. He left scars on all of us. Stop! You ain't pretty boys VIP. Turn back now or by all means roll the dice if you feel it lucky. Look, he's my middle name. Also, screw you. There is no luck, only instincts. And yours are leading you towards death. Oh, I'm rolling the dice, and you're coming up snake eyes. Wait, that's a, that's a bad roll, right? Snake eyes? Whatever, you're gonna die. Luck, huh? Let me introduce you to my lucky fist. It's all of them. That's it, meal ticket! I warned you! <laughs> No, 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 don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. This is not what it looks like. I am not, Jack. Not at all. Again, I cannot stress this enough. I am not Handsome Jack. That's exactly what the real Handsome Jack would say. The old, say something untrue as though it's true maneuver. Classic spycraft. Then why are you disguised as him? Is this one of those sex things you humans always talk about? Well, you look exactly like all these ridiculous statues. So I'm gonna keep pointing my gun at you just in case. Then explain why your face makes me want to hit you until candy comes out. Okay, look, it, it's all... Quite simple. I was a body double, I got paid to look like Jack, talk like Jack, and yeah, I got injected with some of Jack's DNA, so from time to time I want to strangle kittens. It's a long story, but my name is just Timothy. Look, I, I know every unfortunate face in this casino, but you, you're, you're from the outside. No one would be crazy enough to come here. Wait, are you a vault hunter? Right you are, and I'm looking to get into Jack's tower. Yes. I seek entrance into that tower. Yep, trying to get into Jack's tower. That's right, and I want to get into Jack's tower. Ha <laughs> ha, join the club, butt face. Oh, there's that DNA again. Oh, but you know what? Maybe we can help each other out. Oh, hey, you're not dead. <laughs> Way to stay alive, champ. Well, welcome to the Casa de Timothy. 
Oh, right, the hand thing. Jack called it his winning hand. All the doppelgangers have one. Had, just me now, the rest are dead. I didn't kill them, most of them. I killed a couple. Self-defense, we're gonna go with self-defense. Any who's all this bad boy gives me VIP access all across the casino. Comes in, you know, handy. So before I further endanger myself by even talking to you, who are you working for? Doll? Vladoff? TDR? Are they even still a thing? Ah, none of those aegis. Moxie sent me. I was sent here by Moxie. Nah, working a job for Moxie. Actually, Moxie sent me. Wait, sorry, Moxie? <clears throat> Mad Moxie. She's not here, is she? It's fine if she is. I'm not terrified of her at all. I should probably talk to her, though. Yeah, let's talk to her. Let's call her up. Turn on that holo structure, whatever it is, thing. How's my hair? Okay, I got this. Just pour on a little of the old Jack sauce there. Jack always gets what he wants, right? I just gotta be Jack. <sighs> Moxie. <laughs> cool. Got this. Okay. Hey, uh, gorgeous. Timothy, been a while. Yeah, that's right, baby. It's. <laughs> Wait, you remember me? Oh, I never forget a face. Especially when it's being worn by a spineless lackey. Tell me why I shouldn't have the Vault Hunter blow your brains out. Well, because I. Just. Please don't. I'll. <laughs> Give you anything you want? Jack left an open tab with me, and I've sent the Vault Hunter to collect. I want the casino, Timothy. Okay, well, then you also want my brains to stay unblown and in my head and not out. I'm the, I'm the last of the doppelgangers, okay? This winning hand is the only way in or out of Jack's tower. Lucky for you. Then Jack's tab is yours, Timothy, and you can start paying it off right now. Keep an eye on him, Vault Hunter, in case he misbehaves. Oh, thanks! Moxie. Okay, that was a little thing called negotiation. Oh, you really dropped the ball there. Literally. I have no idea where your balls went. <laughs> you showed your throat like a mewling puppy. You folded like a lawn chair. Yeah, you fell apart like a rotten pumpkin. Yeah, Moxie has that effect. Can't believe she remembers me. After Jack got mega rich, he sent me to try to get her back. Took her out to dinner. Best night of my life, actually. I only need to get one thing out of that tower. Once we get in, you and Moxie can have everything else. What's in this for you, then? What do you seek up there? What's up there for you? What is it you're looking for? I want to get the hell off this freaking casino. For all the perks Jack gave us doppelgangers, he didn't trust us. So we're leashed to Hyperion property. If I step off this casino without getting the override codes, boom, this face gets a lot less handsome. So, to recap, bomb in face, codes in tower. Oi, gotta chat with your frisky friend for a moment. Excuse me, I must speak to this dancer for a moment. Yo, I gotta chat with this dancer for a moment. Hey, I need to chat with this dancer for a moment. Get lost! This dancer's Well, there go my customers, though they were sort of deadbeats. So what are you in the market for, big spender? Hi there. You happen to know where Ember's at? I am searching for Ember. Know where Ember's at? Do you know where I can find Ember? Ember? Girl's been busy lately, lighting pretty boy's loaders on fire. But Trent might know where she's posting up. Trent the slut sent me. Do you know where Ember's at? Trent the Slut said you might know Ember's location. Trent the Slut said you might know where Ember's at? Trent the Slut said you could point me in Ember's direction. Well, hello there, fiery lass. Timothy says you might be able to help us get into Jack's tower. We require entrance to Jack's tower. Timothy says you might be willing to help us. Timothy says you can help us get into Jack's tower. He also says you shouldn't set me on fire. I'm not here to fight, for once. Timothy needs your help. Does he now? 
over at Timothy, consumed by handsome demons, a prisoner of a mask. I tried to help him forget the past. But what hope does he have with a face like that? Timothy. He was obsessed with getting into that tower of handsome Jacques. When he left, I feared he would brave the task all alone, but now here you are. I suppose he told you I might lend my fiery arts to his cause? Marry me? I mean, uh, yeah, 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 yes, yes. <clears throat> that is correct. Will you aid us in this hunt? Yeah, and I look forward to seeing how much fire is involved if you help us. Yes, so will you help us, you fiery goddess? Well, maybe I can. But not without my tools. They were on my ship and she is missing. Pretty boy's doing. Recompense for refusing to underwork Timothy. If you retrieve my tools, I would gladly lend a match to the kindling. First, you must locate my ship. Hello, big spender. Welcome to the customer care center. To retrieve an impounded ship, you're gonna need form 34B. However, I can expedite service for a nominal fee. Scanning net worth. Oh, VIP status is a bit out of your league. My mistake. Proceed to client services to pick up your required form. Paperwork! I got out of the assassination business so I can avoid paperwork! Fine! We'll pick up the bloody form! Fine. I will acquire this form, but I will not like it. Oh, great. Forms. How thrilling. Forms? <sighs> There's got to be a better way. All the bots in the casino serve pretty boy. I doubt very much they will let you recover my ship. But I suppose there are some things fire cannot solve. Perhaps. Hey, a valued guest. Do you have your required form? Oh, sorry, there must have been a mix-up. This is Form 34B version 2.4. Only Form 34B version 2.6 is accepted. See, that's why it pays to be VIP. Oh, just piss off with that. This is most infuriating. You have got to be kidding me. Well, this is bullshit. Here's your form. You can turn it in at customer care. Just so you know, we do accept gratuities. Cough, cough. Oh, boy, oh, you are testing me. Here is a tip. You suck. You're already gratuitous. Yeah, not gonna do that. Unbelievable. Locating ship. Location acquired for La Femme Brulee. Oh, that's fun. One moment, I'll figure out where she's being kept. Found her, but before I tell you where she is, impound ship relinquish fee is set at 500 billion dollars. Oh, that's not good. Looks like it's broken. Come back tomorrow. Of course, if you'd like to upgrade to VIP status, I could expedite your payment. This is the worst thing. That has ever happened to me. And I've been stabbed with a cactus before! I must destroy something. I have met jugglers less infuriating than you. Honestly, jugglers! I am so freaking angry right now. I am through with this bullshit. Just rush past the security and get to my ship. Oh! That's a lot of dead bots! Ah, pretty boy's not gonna like this. No problem. I'll fix him up and reprogram him. But what were you thinking? I know they tried to kill you and all, but it is what they were designed to do. Can't blame them for trying. What are you doing here, anyway? I need something from that ship. Also, nice look, boyo. Very... distracted. I need something from that ship. Also, your clothing is... disorienting. I need something from that ship. Also, why does it look like all your clothes are trying to kill each other? I need something from that ship. Also, might I say, brave fashion choices. I know. Great, right? About that ship. Pretty boy locked them all down. Uses them as leverage. But I'm, like, super great, so I might be able to hack in and free your ship. If you help me out. You know the Larboard Bruisers? They're a gang. Soup's Dangeroso. Well, they nabbed one of my loader bot buds. Free him and Freddy. That's me. He'll get you in that shit. I'm calling bullshit, Timothy. 
I know this station is more than just a pleasure palace. Jack always had another secret, but you're saying you don't know anything about that? I swear, Jack never told us what was in the quarry. Said anyone who went down there would share an intimate weekend in the honeymoon suites with him and a grapefruit juicer. I don't even know what that means. For all of our sakes, I hope you're telling the truth. If Jack left a secret weapon in this casino, we can't let Pretty Boy get his sweaty fingers on it. I'll be watching you, Timothy. Oh, she really nails that combo of terror and turn on, doesn't she? Hey, this is nothing, but I can't stop thinking about that time I took her out to dinner for Jack. I mean, totes truth sees here. Do you think she'd ever be up for that again? You know, brutal honesty? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no. Human mating rituals confound me, but as a hunter I will say this. I know a long shot when I see it. I think you have a better chance with Iron Bear. Are you familiar with the concept of an anti-soulmate? Just someone you're never, ever, ever going to get with if you tried for a thousand years? Yeah, do some reading on that. Emergency trash services required. Who is responsible for this mess? Right here, Bio. It was I. Yo. That'd be me. Unacceptable. Huh? You will pay for your crimes against cleanliness. Welcome to Trash Lantern. Here, we take refuge in the refuse. Yes, we live a simple life among the discarded remnants of a world built on greed. Do you smell that? That's the smell of human camaraderie. Now, what brings you to our little scrap of utopia? We're taking down Pretty Boy, and apparently we need your tailoring skills. Fancy going in on a heist? Our task is the destruction of Pretty Boy, but we require your aid in this endeavor. We need a suit. We're taking down Pretty Boy and our crew needs your help. Something about a suit? We're planning on taking out Pretty Boy, and we could use your help passing off a doppelganger as the real Jack. Need help with a suit. Ah, I see. I swore to never return to the wicked world above, but Trashlantis is in danger. Help me save this city, and I will join your cause. The only thing jamming the compactor is a single piece of iron. The beam, our salvation. It must be reinforced or we will die and our dreams with us. If you want your suit, help us to save Trashlantis. Yeah! For Trashlantis! This is an admirable commune. I will do this for Trashlantis. I'm into it. For Trashlantis! I kinda like this place. For Trashlantis! Then welcome, comrade. Now this constructor can reinforce the beam, but it requires some repairs. You must find a compatible AI chip and a new constructor eye. Trash. Wake up, you junk-hearted contraption. Resurrection time has come for you, large one. Live! Live! Sorry, got a little carried away there. Ugh, I'd rather be tearing robots apart instead of putting them back together, but this is fine too, I guess. Trashlantis is safe once again. I have saved Trashlantis. Trashlantis is safe. I have saved Trashlantis. Look at you, assistant to the hero of Trashlantis, which is me. I'm the hero of Trashlantis. So, let's hear the plan then. It is time to wrap things up. What is our path forward? So, what's the plan? Give me the rundown, Timothy. What's the plan? Uh, this is Moxie's job. I'll let her do the talking. Why don't you take us through it, Timothy? All right. Step one. Uh, 
Get, get a crew. Crew's here. Great. Step one complete. <laughs> Go crew. Applause? No, no applause. Moving on. Step two. Get into that tower. We got to take down those death turrets first. And to do that, we need to get into the casino core. That means we need a blueprint. Step three, bypass security. Now, once we kill power to the turrets, the tower's automatic security system's gonna kick in. Big door comes right down where we need to be. If the turrets were the tip of the asshole, this thing is the sphincter. I'm gonna make this asshole thing work. Of course you will, Timothy. The security door is made of solid titanium, but I can burn through it. To do that, I require a very rare substance known as Compound 24. The Vault Hunter will procure it. Yeah, but there's a problem. We need to get into the core to shut off the power to the turrets so Ember can burn through the freaking emergency doors. So we're gonna have to go through a one-of-a-kind security scanner that only opens for hands and drive themselves. So, step four is Tim time. Timothy can pass as Jack, but we'll need one of Jack's hand-tailored suits. Fortunately, I hid one away in my shop. Down. Beginning force field shutdown procedure. Yeah, it looks like this is going to take a second. Hey, whoa, 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 what the hell? Ball Tundra, a little help? Freddy, help? Hack this thing or something? Oh, but I already did, Timothy. And you're going straight to Pretty Boy, Pretty Boy. Pretty Boy made me an offer I couldn't refuse. No hard feelings. Ah, <laughs> who am I kidding? Of course aren't feelings. But I did tell you, only a fool trusts a human. And I'm a human, which makes you a freaking fool! Freddy's out, sucker! Freddy, you beautiful son of a bitch! I trusted you! I will hunt you to my last for this betrayal. Freddy, you fashionable bastard! Freddy, you're not getting away with this! Or that shirt! What the hell is going on down there? Fashionable bastard stole Timothy from right under my nose! He's taking the poor boy out to Pretty Boy up! The fashion blind one is a turncoat. He will deliver Timothy onto Pretty Boy. Freddy double crossed us! He kidnapped Timothy and he's taking him to Pretty Boy! That weirdo Freddy turned on us! He's taking Timothy to Pretty Boy! Okay, it sounds heartless, but Tim did what we needed him for. All we can do now is proceed with the plan. Find the power source for the tower district and shut it down. You got it, Moxie. I will do this thing. En route. Yep, I'm on it. I'm reading a lot of loader activity in that sector. Watch your ass. Ah, uh, ran into a force field thingy here. What should I do? I have encountered an obstacle. How can I proceed? Moxie, hit a snag. How do I get past this force field? There's a force field here. How do I shut it down? The control room is nearby. There should be a manual <laughs> assembly line shut down in there. Got another force field thingy here, Moxie. How do I get past? I have encountered another obstacle. How can I proceed? Moxie, ran into another force field. How can I get past it? Moxie, got another force field here. Help me out. Sorry, sugar. There's nothing on the map. Maybe you can shut it down some other way. Hunter, you actually came for me. I'm freaking trapped, so don't I? Otherwise, this, this is on you. <laughs> Jackpot. Okay, uh, Vault Hunter, just go, I guess. I, I, this place was never gonna let me leave anyway, right? So, uh, I'm really sorry, Moxie. I 
Guess this means no second day. No! No! Timothy, I shouldn't have written you off. We're not leaving you behind. I'm not letting Jack win. Moxie says you're making it out alive, so I'm not going anywhere. Moxie is correct. There must be a way to free you. Moxie's right. You're coming with us. Moxie's right. We're in this together. Okay, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I have an idea. Just... Give me a second. This is really... Really gonna suck, so you... Might wanna plug your ears, kiddos. Diggity shit! Oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, you brilliant idiot. Vault Hunter, grab that hand. Need a hand? Oxy. You know, I've been wondering why did you say yes to dinner that night? I was hungry. Yeah, but Jack. He was the worst. Oh, honey. If I thought you were Jack, I'd have shot you the moment you stepped up to my bar. So... I didn't even fool you a little. Not even a little. I wish you were mine. I wish you So, I didn't even fool you a little. Not even a little. Oh, hi there. I'm ruined! Don't touch me, whoever you are. Because I'm friggin' bad luck! But you, buddy, you're just oozing good luck. I can feel it. Name's Alan. Friends call me All In Alan. Help me get back in Lady Luck's good graces, and I'll make you freaking rich! So, you in? I'm all in, Stephen. Ah, I'm just kidding, Alan. I am all in, Alan. I'm all in, Alan. I'm all in, Alan. See that, baby? I'm sure it's gonna pay out soon, but not with my luck. Like they say, if Lady Luck ain't smiling on you, you better get her attention. You know the Wild Deuces? Nearby gambling gang, real professionals. Their leader, Bruce the Deuce, is a buddy of mine. When he was down on his luck, I lent him my lucky jabber foot. Time to get it back. After Jack died and the casino went on lockdown, Brucey was all pockets, and I saved his life. He's lucky I came along. So Bruce better give that jabber foot back, or he's going snake eyes! Meaning, uh, dang. I knew that jerk was behind this! Okay, okay, new plan. Go to his place and get that damn jabber foot back! Oh, how kind of you, Alan! Sending that fresh new meal ticket our way? Yeah, I'll take that action! Get ready, boys and girls! We're about to have a visitor! Give it your best shot, you golden bastard! I am Hunter, not Hunted. And you are my new quarry. Yeah, you just try it, prick. Try it, and I'll knock your golden teeth out. Ah, uh, it's not there! It's not freaking there! No, screw this! Luck is luck and a foot's a foot! Everybody knows luck collects in the feet! Grab Golden Bullion's foot! I feel for you, boyo. But not really, because Lady Luck is always on my side. Really, she loves me. This concept of luck is rather confusing. Cool, cool. Picking up dismembered limbs. Good thing I make my own luck. Uh, are you real or a demon? Either way, slap me straight, would you kindly? I'm in the fog, dead drunk. So don't hold back. You sure, boyo? This claw of mine ain't messing around. Are you positive? I will strike you with an axe if you are entirely certain. You sure, dude? I mean, I only use my knife. By the way, big fan. 
You sure about this? You have no idea how hard I can punch. Seriously, I don't know how to not punch hard. Can't you hear me, baby? I'm in the fog, drunk. <laughs> Gotta get back on track. And you're gonna help me. Come on, do it for Digby. <laughs> Give me a tap. Digby, oh, yeah, that's the stuff. Up the tempo, yeah, hit the snare. Digby's a coming like a solar flare. Hold steady, Digby. Hold steady. Uh. Hey, Digby. Diggers. Digbo. You, uh, you all right there? Those Junpai jump starts pack a real punch. Has death claimed you, Digby? You cannot have this one death. Give him back. Oh, crap. I killed Digby for Ruth! You still breathing, Digby? I'd really prefer it if you were still breathing. There's that no-talker. See if you can spill his beans. Hiya! Looking for Digby's saxophone. I hunt for Digby's saxophone. Where is it? Looking for Digby's saxophone. Where's it at, mime? I'm searching for Digby's saxophone. Do you have it? Hey, uh, Boyo, are you, are you all right there? How strange. Are your vocal processors malfunctioning? Okay. Yeah, I don't understand you. Think he wants a tip, maestro? Miming? I can be quiet too, watch! Ah! Not talking was the most difficult thing I've ever done! Your silence demonstrates restraint. I respect that. Nice, uh... Miming. Ugh. Your lack of words are absolutely a form of entertainment and not a waste of time. You are valid. Now we're getting somewhere. He's trying to tell you something. Try speaking his language, maestro. Digby's ready to jam. You ready to cut a record? Foxy's bar got a sweet studio set up, but the road's a little rocky. Mind being my roadie, maestro? Of course, Digby. I'm your man. <laughs> the world needs you, boy -o. It would be my pleasure, Digby. Apparently, you are quite beloved amongst the humans. I got your back, Digby. Always. You're safe with me, Digby. My guns are yours. All of them. All right, all right. Let's go then. Oh my. This. This is the best thing I've ever eaten in my entire goddamn life. Thank you so much. Least I could do for a last locked in a closet with her own twosies. You are most welcome. I hope it helps. Hey, no problem. Hope it brightens your day or whatever. Sure thing, you poor, poor woman. But I need more! I need the taste of the most delectable fruit in the universe! Goddamn durian! I love those stinky little guys! Wait, wait! Durian ice cream! Yes! There was a place that sold it in the food court! See if there's any left! My mom used to reward me for good grades by taking me out for durian ice cream. It's a fond memory. Oh, yes! Yes! It's so sweet! I'm so stinky! Oh. Thought you were gonna eat it, not marry it. Are you fornicating with that ice cream? Thought you were gonna eat it, not screw it. Okay, calm down there, champ. That's enough. There's one more thing I need you to find for me, but first, head to the J-spot. There's this goddamn fat bastard that hangs out there who's always coming by to taunt me about living in a goddamn shit closet. Well, he sounds fat anyway. So first, I want you to teach him a lesson by killing him. You have no idea how much hatred I have for this goddamn jackass. Got it, ass. Goddamn great job. Now listen, there's something 
Something else my mom used to prepare for me as a kid. I need you to pick up the fat bastard's spleen and bring it back to me, okay? Sorry, uh, did you just say his spleen? Wait, your mother prepared you human spleen? Sorry, what? You can't be serious. Come on, don't be such a prude about this. It's perfectly natural. Humans have been eating each other since the dawn of time, probably. I mean, haven't you ever been curious? Uh, no. I cannot even comprehend the notion of flavor. So no. Um, no? Absolutely not. Just trust me. God damn. Bring it to me already, will you? He doesn't need it anymore. I'm craving that sweet, sweet organ meat. Yum, yum, yum. What do you want, deadbeat? Hey, big fella. Just here for the bridge tournament. I love me some bridge. Apparently, I am to say that I am here for a bridge tournament. Whatever that is. I'm here for the, uh, bridge tournament. Uh, bridge tournament or whatever. Now let me in. All right. You're cool. Come on in. Oh, you're here! Hey! <laughs> Accidentally stuck yourself to a giant rocket, huh? Ah, uh, been there. Need some help getting unstuck? This looks most inadvisable. I presume you need help getting unstuck from that flying death machine? Do you need help getting unstuck from that thing? Guessing you need help getting unstuck from that rocket? Unstuck? What are you, crazy? This is how I'm getting out of here. All the prep work's done, but I mixed up the steps and strapped myself in before I could start the countdown. And I can't launch without a proper countdown! Climb up there and hit play on the stereo. Well, it's your funeral. Crazy mouthful. You will certainly perish, but if that is your wish. Whatever you say, crazy man. If you say so, you lunatic. Just don't hit the launch button until the countdown is finished. My escape plan is perfect. Perfect! Once I blast off, I just gotta hold my breath for a few hours until I land on a nearby planet. Once I land, I'll find some aliens and convince them of God. I'll live like handsome Jack for the rest of my days. It's gonna be great. Far be it from me to question a man's plans. Now, Glowed, anyway. Again, I must say this is most inadvisable. That's not how any of that works. <clears throat> That's the worst plan I've ever heard. No, 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 I got this. <clears throat> Are you seriously working for that raving idiot, Max? Whatever. Pretty boy put a price on your head, so we'll take you down, no problem. And yeah, I took that idiot stereo. Come take it back if you can. <laughs> Spoiler alert, you can't. I'll spoil you with, uh, bullets. Uh, uh I, I got nothing. I always acquire that which must be acquired. We'll see about that, Rudy. Oh, you just try to stop me. I, I, whatever you do, you better stay away from my rocket, or else... Hey, Max! You've got a much better chance in this thing. Maybe we steal this for you instead. This rocket appears to be superior. Are you certain you wouldn't rather steal Rudy's? Max, I think you might have a better chance of surviving if you stole Rudy's rocket. Are you sure you wouldn't rather steal Rudy's rocket? It looks a lot, uh, safer. Not a chance! He thinks he can steal my genius plan, does he? He'll never get off the ground with that thing! Trash his rocket! That should lure him out. That mad boy won't last long out there. I like his style, though. He will surely perish. He is so doomed. Well, that happened. My name's Joy, and I'm a good boy. I'm not like those killbots you've seen around. People say I've got a heart of gold and can't hurt anybody. Oh, I shouldn't have told you that. Oh, please don't rip my heart out. Oh, don't you worry about that, you big metal boy -o. I will not harm you, fellow bot. Aw, I'm not gonna hurt you, big guy. I promise. 
Oh, Beta, you seem like a nice bot. I would never harm you. Well, that's a relief. Listen, my whole life, all I've ever wanted was to have a picnic with a friend. Can you help? Oh, but I don't have any picnicking supplies. Could you gather some things for me? You see, I'm defective. I got thrown into the trash because I refused to fight. I'm a lover, not a fighter. But not like those DTF bots. That's a different thing. Where are we getting this picnic started? Oh, this is gonna be nice. What is our destination, you friend? We shall picnic with great gusto. So, you sweet boy, where are we doing this thing? You know, I'm actually looking forward to this. Where to, Joy? Oh, I've already picked out the perfect spot. Nice and quiet. It might be a bit of a hassle to get there, but I know that with the power of friendship, we're up to it. Let's go, friend! What the hell is going on? Ugh, what is this god-awful reek? Don't tell me. My sister Sandy put you up to this, didn't she? That bastard! Not really, our parents were very happy together. Look, enough about our picturesque childhoods. Help me get back at my bully of a sister and I'll double your reward. Yeah, siblings, I get it. Count me in. I have no kin, no blood. I am the only one of my kind in this universe. Siblings sound troublesome. I am sure that this will solve the dispute. Family's dumb, but I like rewards. I used to beat up all my siblings at once. Sign me up. Now we're talking. Here's the plan. We're gonna make her slot machines pay out the wazoo until she's dead broke. <laughs> Get a hold of the modified slot machine algorithm, then we'll install it in her mainframe. I know a guy, kind of shady, but he owes me a big favor. Go talk what to him. Hey, big spender, what do you think might tickle your fancy today? Leah sent me bio. Looking for a slot machine algorithm that'll pay out big time. You got it? Leah sent me. I seek a hacked slot machine algorithm that will pay out gratuitously. Do you possess it? Ah, yes, Leah. You tell her this makes us even. No more favors. Leah sent me. Heard you're the guy to talk to if I'm looking for a hacked slot machine algorithm. You got it? Leah sent me. Looking for a hacked slot machine algorithm, shady man. You got what I need? Ah, uh, yes, Leah. You tell her this makes us even. No more favors. Uh, now listen, this thing is only good for a single use, and the effect will self-correct after a little while. Not perfect. If anyone asks, you didn't get it from me.